Well, good Monday evening, everybody. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Rick Bork. So, we just got off work, got home, had a little snack. And, uh, gave you a brief run around what we got going on this week. It's supposed to actually, we had a 60 plus percent chance of rain all week. For the next five days, we got over a 60 percent chance of rain. So, it looks like we got a little bit of a break here tonight. We're going to drop a bale for the cows and drop a bale for the horses. They're going to want some hay to eat. Um, horses did a pretty good job. They've been cleaning up over there. So we're going to give them a new bale. We're going to give the cows a hay bale. And ultimately, my kind of my project here the next couple of nights while it's raining and things like that is we're going to try to get a home built and cleaned out in the garage for the race car. And then if we get a chance, we'll give you a walk around on the race car. But... You can see in here, this is ultimately where I want my race car to live. Now, my problem is, is I was hoping that I was going to have concrete poured in the garage pretty soon and be able to take all the stuff that's jammed in there and piled in there and a grenade bomb went off in there and or, sort it and organize it and put it down in the other garage. The problem is, is the condition my driveway's in and with this rain that keeps coming and coming and coming. They're probably not going to get up my driveway with a concrete truck for at least a month. At least a month. That can change really quick. If we get some nice dry weather and things dry out quickly, then obviously that'll speed that up. But we still got some work down to do down in there. We got some dirt work to do to get ready, but it's not a huge deal. It's a couple days worth of work, so if things start drying out, we will definitely shift gears. But for now, we are going to go in there, <laughs> and we're going to start moving stuff around. And ultimately, we got to clean up some of this stuff in front of the garage. Those totes got dropped off last fall, right before it snowed, and that's where they ended up in their home. So we got a whole bunch of scrap metal on the other side of the garage. It's, again, as soon as the driveway heals up and we can get a scrap dumpster dropped off, we're going to clean up all the scrap on the other side of the garage because we have to fix the wall where the wind threw a post through it. Let's go over here. I don't think I showed you guys this. I've been slacking. This is kind of one of those things where, oh, yeah, I had to... Get that taken care of. The wind got a hold. There used to, you see the posts out here. There used to be some steel on there. The wind got a hold of it and uh, threw it through the side of the garage. And you can see, got all the way up and hit the roof up there and everything. So we got to get rid of all this, get all that cleaned up, and being that we're cleaning it up to get moving it to get rid of it, so we can get. <laughs> being that we're cleaning it up and moving it. To fix the garage we may as well get rid of it so i'm gonna drop some hay bales for these critters and then we'll start cleaning in the garage and we'll take you along with us see what kind of crap we can find in there because 90 percent of it i in here i don't even know what the hell's in there right now but come back later and find out I'm going to go feed some cows and take care of the critters, and then we will jump into the garage and make the race car a new home. Okay, guys, I have to apologize for yesterday. I uh, couldn't finish filming because my phone went dead. Once I got down to like 7%, I, wasn't, I filmed a little bit before, and then I thought I was going to be able to come back and wrap it up. I knew my battery was getting low. I got down to like 7%, and then I won't let you record any video. So we did a little uh, cleaning in here last night. We got probably... Half of that stuff cleaned up. That left side was real piled up. We got some of the car tires put in there for the race car. Tonight's project's going to be doing that west wall there. Cleaning up my pet peeve of myself. My pet peeve of my own myself is I keep all these little pieces of steel because I think I'm going to do something with them someday. And I never do. I mean, once in a great while, it's like, yeah, I could use this piece for a gusset here or there. But... I can't keep all that crap. So my plan is, well, we got to clean up this junk too, as long as it's not raining too hard. We're going to take one of those 300 gallon totes. We are going to cut the top off. We're going to punch some holes in the bottom and that's going to be the new home for all of that little tiny scrap metal. So hopefully that's going to keep things contained a little bit. And then we will get, I don't know if you can see the, there's a Christmas tree there and it's almost made. It's got to go up, up there. But 
then we can get the race car put over here and we can work on this side of the garage so now well, we're trying we're gonna try to get this organized and then pour concrete in that garage and then I can take my stuff that I want from in here and put it in there and hopefully both places will be organized I'll count on it right so we are gonna head off to work because you know that job thing that pays for all this stuff and then uh, we'll come back and we'll get back after this make another video see what we can find we found some pretty cool stuff last night we'll go through that later so hopefully you guys have a good day I do appreciate you guys watching please throw me a thumbs up if you haven't subscribed take the opportunity to do so and share this stuff out throw a link to your buddies throw a link to your family your friends your enemies I don't care throw it out there to somebody get somebody to watch it for me I would much appreciate it we're gonna work at maybe setting up some other um, maybe some other ways of promoting the videos that I make but uh, that whole social media kind of thing is getting gets pretty tough for me to really enjoy or keep up with but anyway I gotta go to work we'll see you guys again next time